Good morning, and welcome to Walking with Rhonda. We are going to have a low impact walking class today, and it's a beautiful day out today, so let's get some exercise. I hope you have fun joining me. Um, we're just going to start with some low exercise. I'm going to reset my timer here to track. Okay. Um, just walking in place. Yeah, make sure you have a bottle of water, comfortable shoes, and some pants that are easy to move in for this class. That's all you need. If you would like to use some weights, you can use a can of vegetables or uh, a small dumbbell or um, a bag of beans is really good because it's easy to grip. But anything that's small that has a little bit of weight, you can hold in your hand. And then you can use it as a weight for this class. But it's not required. You can just walk in place. We're going to warm up a little bit and get our heart rate going. Warming up is good for the muscles and keeps you from getting stiff and uh, injuries. No injuries if you warm your muscles up. You don't want to pull anything or strain anything. So just walking. And then you can walk side to side. Warm up the hip muscles along with the legs. going. This works good if your hands are cold and in the morning when you, before you exercise sometimes your hands get cold. This little warm up does good to get you going, get you warmed up a little bit. All right, now we're going to just take one step forward and one step back. Forward and back. This is similar to walking and works on the muscles of your legs and your feet. Good for your balance. Just up one, back one. Up one, back one. Real simple, something you can do at home. Up one, and back one. Up one, and back one. It's a beautiful day. If you're going this way, feel free to stop in and see us here at Premier Fitness. We would love to chat with you. Just tell them you're part of Rhonda's fitness family and you were watching the class and you would like to just say hi. We'd love to just see you come in. Okay, now that we're warmed up, we're going to step it up a little bit and get our heart rate up a little bit more. We're going to do what's called a shuffle, and it's real simple. It's nothing hard. Just one, two, three. 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 This is a good exercise for your balance because you're stopping and starting. Three. One, two, 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 three. If at any time you have any pain or you don't feel like you could do this movement, just do your walking in place and keep up with us. Or you can steady yourself with a chair. One, two, three. 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 
And we're going to go back to walking. And three. And just walking. Maybe you could raise your legs up just a little bit higher. Get your arms going just a little bit more. If you do this three times a week, you can tell doctors, say, hey, I got my three days of exercise in this week, and I'm feeling great. Twenty-five minutes three times a week is what they recommend for exercise. Now we're going to go to the side. We're going to do a shuffle to the side. If this is uncomfortable for you, just do the walking. And then one, one, two, three. 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 This is a little more challenging. It um, works on your balance. Three. And coordination. Three. One, two, 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 three. And then we'll go back to walking. See? Very simple. Just a light, easy workout. And I am sure glad that you're joining me today because working out is always better with friends. And just a little walking. I try to switch it up a little bit, keep you interested, keep you from getting too bored with just the walking. So we're going to do some side steps again. Only this one we're going to add an clap because we're going to call this a half jack and it's without the jumping the same as a jumping jack so step to the right clap step to the back step right clap and back right 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 and back, right, 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 and back. This is working your shoulders, and your arms, and your hips, and your legs, and right, and back, and right, and back and right and back and right and back and right and back right and back and back to walking Let's do some knee lifts in three, two, and one. Up and up. Right and left. 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 And back to walking. We'll do just some simple side steps. 
No clapping this time. And three, two, and one. Right and left. 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 If you want to use your arms, you can go like this. And left. Right 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 and then left. Right and left. Right and left. Okay, and back to walking. See, we are just a simple class that you can do to help keep you fit, keep you moving, get your joints moving. Anybody can do this class. It's not hard. If you have any trouble at all, though, don't be afraid to grab onto your chair to steady you or to just sit and move your legs right in your chair. Okay, we're going to go do the forward shuffle again in three, two, and one. One, two, three. 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 And back to walking. This spring weather is getting me excited for exercise. Makes you want to get outside. I hope you're, well, those of you that are watching are able to get outside and enjoy some of the sun. If not, you can work out with Rhonda right in the comfort of your own home. I'm going too fast for you. You feel free to slow down to your own pace. This is the aerobic part of the video where you try to get your heart rate up. So I'm going to step a little faster. Almost like I'm marching. You can make it marching. Just raise your legs up a little higher and your arms up a little higher. Be marching.
exercise improves the, your mental status as well, helps you to not be depressed. It's very beneficial. Staying in the house with COVID a lot gets somebody depressed. So if you can exercise and get your mind on that, it helps you not to be depressed. Okay, we're going to start slowing down. We're going to make slower steps, cool off a little bit so that we can do some stretches when we're done. We want to bring our heart rate down, just walk a little easier. Still moving, but just easier. A little slower. some side steps for a minute so we're going to do that in three two and one one back right back right back right back right back right and back right and back right and back We'll do some deep breathing. We'll stand still for this. We're just going to raise our hands up and inhale and down and exhale. Up, inhale, down, exhale. Up, inhale, and down, exhale. Up, inhale, and down. Up and down. There. Now we're all cooled off. So let's do some stretches. Stretches are good for the muscles so that after exercise, you don't get stiff and get a lot of soreness later. So I like to use a chair. And you can sit right on the chair. Make sure you're on there good and solid. And you can put one leg out and lean down and grab your ankle and hold for 20 seconds. And you'll feel it pull on the back of your leg. And that will help you stretch those hamstrings. As both legs out, point your toes to the sky and hold there. And we're gonna count for 20 seconds to make sure we get our 20 seconds. One, Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, and twenty. Now we're going to stretch our quad muscles. And we're going to push your leg back behind you and hold. And we're going to count to twenty. One, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, and twenty. And you want to do that on both sides. Stretch your legs out. Make sure you hold good onto your chair so you're not unsteady. You can push your leg back and sit up straight, and you'll feel that leg stretch. And just count to twenty. Make sure you get a good stretch. Okay, that's good. Now you've stretched your legs, and thank you for working out with Rhonda, and I hope you have a great day.